What's up you guys? It's me DC Moport. Sorry about the size on my face. Today we're doing an installment on JBL speakers on my Dodge Charger. And um, I'm just gonna show you how to do like on the door speakers right now because I'm just doing little by little and showing each step how we do everything. So catch that right now. These are the DBL speakers. They're not high end like the $150 ones, $250. They're basic. I'm gonna try and go high hand on this car because it's a basic car. It's my daily car, so we're just gonna do basic right now. So you can also remove this if you want to basically. You want this if you want to fancy, but it's inside of the car. So you're not gonna see that, so I'm not gonna install. All right, you guys, if you have a Dodge Charger 2006, Hemi, SRTA, SC, SXT, it's gonna be the same thing. It may be like from 2006, 2010. You got screws right here down here in the door under here too that one down here you have a couple screws on the side once you remove that it's going to be the easiest thing to do so i'm going to start doing it right now put it up and once you put it out don't take it out because you're going to have a little flip thing right here you just have to unlock it and just push it up and you're free to go the wires on the uh, door handle like the and it pops off and that's it. The door's out, ready to go. You see this is a stock piece of crap speaker. Switch it for this one, the JBL. So you're gonna see how the difference works, everything. This one and show you the difference of sound quality bass works. So you can see it's better. The stability and everything is much, much better. How it? Okay. okay, this is so easy. You see, this is negative and this is positive. White is positive, so once you just put it right there, installed, and then negative. There it goes, and we're done. Another thing I just have to see this adapter. Just put it. And it clips on and that stuff it in back in there these speakers are way so small and it fits like a glove right there so it's made for these stupid these are this one has like a different form of like the speaker and when i install it the top part doesn't want to fit so i'm like getting frustrated so but i noticed and i kind of didn't really pay attention to it speaker from moving so it doesn't shake or rumble on the on the metal and it had this stupid thing so it went all the way so I was getting frustrated I was like why the hell does it let me let the speaker go all the way and that's why I noticed that when I was putting it this thing doesn't move or doesn't like it's not rubber it's just pure plastic so I just cut it off and hopefully it works for this time so let's see end of the video 
The only thing you gotta do is just redo everything I did in the beginning, just screw everything back together, connect the cables back where they go, test everything back perfectly and fine, and after that, you're set, done for the speakers. Like you said, I said, um, these are just basic JBLs. You hear the quality is, has more of a tone, more of a sound that gives it more like a crispy, perfect sound on it. The other ones are stock, so the sound is kind of crappy and garbage. She recorded both of the speakers. You're gonna see like which one sounds way better. You can see which one's more like a sound, like differently. So just let you guys know there's gonna be another video about tweeters and the back speakers and the subwoofer. So stay tuned and hopefully you guys get to see the rest of the videos. And it's always easy. Deuces.